To begin with this look, I'm grabbing my Wet n Wild Fergie Eye Primer. I'm applying it to my lid and also to my lower lash line. And then I'm using my fingers to blend it all in. Next, I'm applying tape to the outer edges of my eye. If you want to see how I do this, check out my Smudge Winged Liner tutorial video. Next, I'm grabbing my e.l.f. eyeshadow brush and I'm going to be dipping it into this color here. I am patting this color all over my eyelid, concentrating mostly on the inner corner to the middle of the lid. I'm grabbing my BH Cosmetics blending brush and dipping it into this color here. I'm using this color to define my crease and outer V. I'm using my usual windshield wiper motions to blend it all in. I also add a little bit more of the brown to really start to deepen it up. I'm dipping my blending brush into this black matte color here and deepening up the outer V and crease with it. Remember as you bring your brush higher up into the crease to lighten the pressure on your brush. This will help to blend things even further. Next I'm grabbing my Urban Decay eyeshadow brush and I'm dipping it into this matte white color here. I'm patting it onto my brow bone and this will really highlight that area. Now soften the edges with a blending brush. I'm grabbing my Visine and I'm going to be putting a little drop onto my finger. Then dipping my finger into that first rose gold coppery shadow. And then I just pat the shadow onto my lid with my finger. Kind of smudging just a little bit to get a nice pigmented color. I'm grabbing my blending brush once again and using it to blend out all of the edges so it's nice and seamless. Now I'm grabbing my black Palladio eyeliner. And I'm going to use this to start forming my outer V. So I'm just following the line of the tape and then also bringing it onto my upper lash line and then my upper water line. And just really lining that out nicely. And then I start to build up the wing a little bit more. Now I'm grabbing this matte black color again and dipping my e.l.f. eyeshadow brush into it. And I'm just going to use this to build up and smudge out the wing. If you want a more detailed tutorial, check out my smudged wing liner once again. I'm now grabbing that brown color and then I'm going to use that to smudge or blend out the wing even further. And then you'll notice that you'll have to go back in with the black to deepen it up just a little bit. Once you have everything blended the way that you want it, it's time to remove the tape so you have a clean edge on your wing. I'm grabbing the black Palladio liner and, and lining my lower waterline and also bringing it a little bit down to my lower lash line. I dipped my e.l.f. eyeshadow brush into that same black matte color and then I'm just using it to smudge and blend out the lower lash line. Now I'm dipping into this color here and just applying it to the inner corner to brighten up and finish off that area. I forgot to record this part but then I applied my Amora Slashes number 118 and also my L'Oreal Telescopic Shocking Extensions Mascara to my upper and lower lashes. And here's your finished look. I hope this was helpful for you guys and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!